Hey, what's up guys? This is Raul here and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be teaching you this sound. And this sound is called the inward bass. So before we get started, make sure you leave a like, comment and subscribe if you're new and also follow me on Twitch if you haven't. So before we get started with the tutorial, I just want to say that this sound is not an easy sound to learn. So please, if you can't get this sound, on the first try or if you like a week or a month into doing this sound don't give up because this sound takes a long time to learn I mean some people can probably learn it like fast but there's also some other people that's gonna take them a while to learn it so don't give up and keep practicing it alright so since this is a really hard sound to explain I'm gonna try my best to uh, explain and tell you how I learned it so before I get started I just wanna tell you a quick story of how I learned this sound so the way I learned this sound um, it was a weekend, right? And then I went to a store and then I was like, you know what? Let me try to do this sound. And then I just went like, eh, 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 eh. and then I was like, oh, that's, that's the inward bass. And then I just kept like doing that. Okay. So the way I learned how to do this sound is by doing a throat bass and breathing in. So like this, like, eh, 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 eh. So that's how I learned how to do this sound. And the, I know there's a lot of tutorials that tell you to do a throat bass or a chest bass, but just breathing in and that's the inward bass. And that is true, but also there's a little more to it to like get the vibration on the back of your throat. Um, so I'm going to try my best to try to explain to you how you can get that little vibration that makes the inward bass. So the way I'm going to try to explain this tutorial is by doing three steps. So the first step you want to do is talking while breathing in so like this like i'm talking and breathing in i'm talking and breathing in right now so that's the first step you want to do you just breathe in and talk at the same time like this like this you breathe in and you talk okay so the second step you want to do is breathe in but you want to make sure you're breathing in through the back of your throat like this it's kind of like a whisper but a whisper in the back of your throat and breathing in so it will sound like this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the third step is just putting step one and step two together. And that's what's going to give you the little vibration to make the inward bass. So you want to do step one, which is talking and breathing in. Yeah, I'm talking and breathing in. I'm talking and breathing in. I'm talking and breathing in. And then put the second step to that. And then you get this. Yeah. Yeah. So again, first step is breathe in and talk. Yeah, yeah, I'm breathing in and talking. And then the second step is just breathing in, but with the back of your throat like this. And then you put both of them together and you get this. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's pretty much what you're going to need to make this sound. This is not an easy sound to learn. So make sure you don't give up if like the first time you do it and it doesn't come out like it doesn't work like that some people will learn it fast some people will learn it it will take them longer right and also some people's inward bass sounds different than other people's right the way i do my inward bass is a little different than most people so once you get the first step and the second step and you finally get the inward bass which is the <sighs> so again the first step is just breathing in and talking yeah yeah i'm talking and breathing in and then the second step is just breathing in, but through the back of your throat like this. Okay, so you put step one and step two together and you get this. So once you feel that little vibration on the back of your throat and you already got the inward bass down, the way I make my inward bass sound the way I make it sound is I don't do my inward bass with my throat. I actually do it with my nose. So I do my inward bass different than most people. That's why it sounds a little different. And some people think it's a snore bass. So I do my inward bass like this. Right, it's coming through my nose. It's not coming through my throat. It's coming through my nose. So yeah, my inward bass is coming through my nose. So like if I close my nose, nothing will come out. So my inward bass is more like a nasal inward bass. That's why it sounds different. So if you want to learn how to do this inward bass, which is, I would call it the nasal inward bass, all you got to do is take that vibration from the back of your throat 
and and just close your mouth and put it to your nose. So all you want to do is just take that vibration from your throat, close your mouth, and it will make the sound go through your nose like this. And the other variation of the inward bass is the high pitch inward bass, which is like this. So to do this variation of the inward bass, all you gotta do is just uh, hit a high note but breathing in like and then add that to your inward bass and it will make it sound like this. And that's how you do the high pitch inward bass. Okay, so those are all the steps you will need to make the inward bass. Like I said, this is not an easy sound to learn. So you gotta make sure you gotta keep practicing it. So I hope this video was helpful and you can learn the inward bass. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.